Hi friends! Welcome to my eighth episode of BU Yogini Yoga Classes. Today's class is about 20 minutes and it is basically a sun salutation warm-up. So it's going to be a brief class, pretty simple, something to do in the morning when you don't have a lot of time or maybe you want to do another physical activity and this is something that you can do to warm yourself up. So go ahead and start with a comfortable seated position, hips above the knees, shoulders relaxed, eyes closed, and let's take a few breaths here together. Inhaling deep into your belly, warming up the diaphragm, exhaling navel to spine. Taking that breath in, feeling it Fill up your body all the way down from your toes up through the crown of your head. And exhale, allow yourself to release and yet to keep yourself as big as possible, to feel yourself expand even as you exhale. Take a few more breaths at your own pace, really just paying attention to how your diaphragm moves with each inhale and exhale and how your breath can affect different parts of your body, warming up different parts of your muscles simply just by concentrating on your breath. And on your next breath, let's bring our palms together at the heart center taking a moment to recognize your effort getting on the mat today, feeling the connection between your heart and your physical self and feeling the space in between your palms, allowing there to be a breath in between. On your next inhale, draw your arms up over your head releasing your palms, hands all the way down to your side on an exhale. Slowly open your eyes and then inhale, bring your arms up, back up to the top to meet. Exhale, palms back to the heart center. Take a moment here. Gathering yourself, getting ready for a physical practice. Release your hands, come off of your sitting position. If you had a blanket or a pillow underneath, just place it on the side. And then come to all fours, knees underneath your hips, palms and wrists underneath your shoulders, creating a really strong foundation here. Let's warm up your spine a little bit before we move into our sun salutations. So take a breath, inhale into your belly, exhale, navel to spine. And then on your next inhale, reach your heart forward, your hips back. Exhale, curve your spine, navel to spine, cat pose. So moving with your breath, starting off slow. Inhale, really feel every small change in your spine as you move between these two positions. Try to make it fluid. Feel your muscles interacting with one another along your spine to create these shapes. And use your breath to stretch into them. If you find a place where you feel tightness or soreness, maybe stay in that moment for just another breath to really breathe into it and release that tension. On your next inhale, come back to neutral spine, curl your toes under, exhale, downward facing dog, reaching your heels toward the mat, your inner thighs toward the back of the room, your sit bones toward the sky, using your tricep muscles to hug in your arms toward your ears, and at the same time relaxing your shoulders, relaxing your neck, pressing your hands into the floor. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, bend your knees and step or hop to the front of your mat, standing forward bend. Inhale, reach your heart forward, flat spine. 
and exhale fold. Maybe placing the backs of your hands on the mat for a nice little wrist stretch. And then inhale, sweep your arms up into the sky, come all the way up into mountain pose. Exhale, hands to heart center. We're gonna be warming up our spine a little bit more before we begin our sun salutations. Inhale, bring your arms overhead. Exhale, folding over with a straight spine with control and muscular engagement all the way down, standing forward bend. You can shake your head. And then inhale, come all the way back up to standing. Exhale, hands to heart center. Keep moving here with your breath. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, folding forward. Inhale, reach your heart forward, flat spine, moving through that flat spine all the way up to standing pose, mountain pose. Exhale, hands to heart center. And now we'll begin our sun salutations. So you've warmed up your spine, we're really ready to engage our muscles. Inhale, reach up, arms overhead, exhale, moving through that flat spine, engaging that core all the way down to the mat, hands planted on the mat, if you can, otherwise fingertips or on your shins. Inhale, come to a flat spine, reaching forward. Exhale, plant your hands, step back into plank. So high push up, engaging your core, pushing your heels back, shoulders over wrists, heart a little forward. And then exhale, knees down to the mat, chest and chin down to the mat, keeping your elbows near your ribs. Bring your hips forward, inhale, cobra. Reaching your heart forward, pressing into the tops of your feet, taking a breath here, and exhale. Fold your heart back down to the mat, curl your toes under, through bent knees, come back into downward facing dog on your exhale. Take a breath here. Now you can, of course, remain with those modifications as we move through our sun salutations. I'll also show you a few other things you can do. Exhale, bend your knees and step or hop to the front of your mat. Standing forward bend. Inhale, reach your heart forward. Flat spine. Exhale, fold. Looking through your knees, your shins, toward the back of the room. Taking a moment here to really feel that stretch in the back of your legs. And then moving through the flat spine, inhale all the way up to standing mountain pose. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, fold forward, engaging your core, reaching your hips up toward the sky, your sit bones up toward the sky. Standing forward bend. Inhale, reach your heart forward. Flat spine. And then exhale, plant your hands and step back into plank. So we're setting our strong foundation here. We're pushing away the floor, pushing away the mat. And then exhale, bending at the arms, coming all the way down and pushing your feet through to cobra or upward facing dog. Exhale, curl your toes under, press back into downward facing dog. So that's another modification that you can do, of course. You can do what suits your body. Taking a breath here in downward facing dog, really press those heels down toward the mat. Really relax your neck and your face. Inhale, lift your heels, bend your knees and step or hop to the front of the mat. Standing forward bend. Inhale, taking a breath with a flat back. Exhale, fold. Maybe the palms or the back of your palms, back of your hands on the mat. A nice wrist stretch there. And then using the power through your legs and your core, Inhale, come all the way up to standing. Exhale, hands to heart center. Take a breath here. Inhale, sweep your arms up overhead. Exhale, fold all the way over with a flat spine. Standing forward bend, feeling that stretch through the back body. 
and then inhale, raise your heart, crown of the head reaching opposite of the tailbone, flat spine, exhale, fold, step back into plank, high push up, engaging that core, exhale, navel to spine, and then on your next exhale, come down through chaturanga and inhale into upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. So there's three different versions of our sun salutations. Go with whatever one suits your body best today. Tomorrow it might be different. Taking a breath here in downward facing dog, really stretching back those heels. Inhale, raising the heels, exhale, bend the knees and step or hop to the front of the mat. Make sure to release that tension. And then inhale, raise your chest, flat spine, exhale, fold. Inhale, raise your arms up, come all the way up to mountain pose. Exhale, hands to heart center. And we will do a few sun salutations at a quicker pace. So each movement will have its own inhale or exhale. So take a breath here in mountain pose, gather your foundation. Inhale, raise your arms up, exhale, forward bend. Inhale, raise your chest forward. Exhale, step back into plank. Continue the exhale down through chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, raise the heels. Exhale, standing forward bend. Step or hop. Inhale, flat spine. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, come all the way up to stand. Exhale, hands to heart center. Keep moving with your breath here. Sweeping the arms up on your inhale, reaching tall. Exhale, moving through the flat spine all the way down. Inhale, flat spine, raising the heart toward the front of the room. Exhale, step back into plank and continue the exhale through chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog, reaching the heart forward. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, raise the heels. Exhale, jump or hop to the front of the mat. Inhale, raise the heart up, the chest up, flat spine. Exhale, fold. Inhale, come all the way up, hands overhead. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, sweeping the arms up. Maybe a little arch in the spine. Exhale, fold over. Inhale, reaching the heart forward. Exhale, you can step or hop back into the plank and through chaturanga. If you do the hop, make sure that you land in chaturanga with bent elbows. Downward facing dog. Exhale, hop or step to the front of the mat. Inhale, flat spine. Exhale, fold. Inhale, come all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, fold all the way over. Inhale, flat spine. Again, you can step or hop back into chaturanga with bent elbows. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a breath here and downward facing dog. Maybe even sigh out any tension or heat. And then inhale, come into plank. Holding here for a few breaths, engaging that core. The inside thighs are reaching toward the sky. And then exhale, downward facing dog. Take an inhale and exhale. And then inhale again into plank, reaching the heels back. Exhale, downward facing dog. So we're working our core here a little bit. Inhale, come back to plank, reaching the heart forward, engaging the core, 
navel to spine on the exhales. And then exhale, downward facing dog. You can walk your dog slightly if that feels good at this moment. Really reaching back through the inside thighs, the sit bones toward the sky. Shake your head no here, releasing the tension in your neck. And then inhale, raise the heels, exhale, bend the knees, and this time come all the way down into child's pose. Allowing your spine to just relax down through the crown of your head into the earth, allowing there to be a curve in your spine. Maybe even close your eyes here, completely relax. And listen to your breath. On your next inhale, come back into tabletop, making sure your shoulders are over your wrists and your knees are underneath your hips. On your inhale, come into cow, exhale, curving your spine, cat pose, taking a few of these at your own pace, releasing any tension out of your spine. Inhaling and exhaling, moving with your breath. And when you're ready, on your next exhale, come into a neutral spine. Bring your feet behind you. Cross your ankles and sit back onto your bum, bringing both legs forward in Dandasana. Inhale, reaching the arms up overhead. Exhale, fold over reaching for the calves, the shins, ankles, or the feet. Inhale, reach your heart forward. Exhale, fold. Surrendering to the gravity of this pose, let your spine completely relax over. And feel the stretch in the whole back body. This is one of the best poses you can do for your back, if you have any back pain at all. Inhale, reach that heart forward one more time. Exhale, fold the crown of the head, reaching long. And then slowly walk your hands back toward your hips. Come into a tall spine. And then go ahead and sit back all the way, hugging your knees into your chest. Rocking your knees side to side. Giving yourself a little massage there. And then exhale, bring your knees to the left side of the room. The right hand opens to the right with your chest open, the right shoulder still in contact with the mat. For a nice twist. Remembering that the spine is long as we twist so we don't sacrifice our lower back. Breathe into your right rib cage. Inhale, come back through center. Exhale, knees to the right. Open up to the left through the chest and the heart. The left shoulder still is in contact with the mat. And your spine is long as you twist. Breathe into your back body. Inhale, come back to center, hug your knees in one more time, maybe lifting your forehead towards your knees. And then exhale, release into supine cobbler's pose, one hand on your belly, one hand on your heart, the soles of the feet together. Breathe into both of your hands, feel your diaphragm expanding. 
And then inhale, reach your legs long, your arms up overhead, stretching your entire body on your mat. Taking a few breaths here. And then exhale, bending your knees one more time. Use your knees to help yourself roll up into a seated position. Relaxing your shoulders, hands on top of your thighs or your knees. Let's inhale, raising our hands up overhead, palms together, and watch them as they come down to your forehead, your third eye chakra. Exhale, bring them to your lips. And then exhale, bring them to your heart center, bowing your head to greet your heart. We bow to the light, love, and truth inside of each and every one of us and inside of everything. Namaste. Thank you so much for practicing with me today and remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more classes.